in this video we will talk about an error that is cannot read properties of null so how to solve this error and why this error is coming as you can see here this error is coming on the line 4 here that is c dot get data range dot get values as you can see here here it is calling ss dot get seed by name then data so if if you will just uh, console this seed then let's see what it's happening As you can see, when they're consoling the seed, then it is giving the null. So here from the null, it is asking get data range. That's why it is telling cannot read properties of null. So why this null is coming? Uh, because as you can see here, we have this Excel seed having the name data. But in the Excel seed, we have this form response one. That you have to just give here uh, inside the Excel seed, whatever written here, like here, we have this form response one. So here you have to give here form response one for you. You will just uh, give the name what name you have so I will... now i will run again as you can see execution is completed hopes you understand the video thank you for watching